Good morning, good noon, and a beautiful evening from India. Welcome to Global Talk Show by Business Power Academy, Netherlands. And today this show is so, so amazing because we have two Supriya, one is host and one is guest. And I'm sure you're going to have double the maka you can say in Hindi. Well, moving to this journey of Global Talk Show, Today, we have an eminent, a renowned personality from India, Dr. Supriya Patan. Welcome, Dr. Supriya, to our show today. Yeah, thank you very much for, for this warm welcome. And actually, I appreciate where uh, uh, Wings, actually, you uh, called all the famous personalities and you uh, interacted with them, you uh, talked with them uh, about their journey. So it's a really incredible job. Keep it up. Thank you, Supriya. Uh, well, if I am moving forward, let me apprise you folks about Dr. Supriya. She, as I said earlier, she is a renowned personality, assistant professor, research supervisor of IIC president in Oriental University, Indore. That is heart of India, Madhya Pradesh. And I am so, so super excited to take this show on and before taking this show on along with my global audience dr supriya you have an incredible life journey which is so motivating and inspiring and we all would love to know what's that secret so would love to know your journey please uh, see uh, actually uh, i have lots of connections uh, with the uh, foreign speakers with the foreign educators uh, with the uh, very renowned uh, business pro uh, across the borders. So the secret behind this connections, this global connections, uh, is that actually uh, I follow that you have to be very humble, number one. And number second, you have to be very kind when you talk, to, uh, when you talk someone, okay? So you have to be very honest you have to be very decent and if you are decent if you are honest in your conversation in your talk in a, in a, if you show kindness towards the others so definitely people wants to connect with you people wants to uh, believe in yourself so i think this is the secret kindness is most important thing actually kindness shows in your conversation that's really great, Dr. Supriya. And yes, I do believe that kindness and gratitude really defines your personality and sculpture your personality. And if you want to connect with the people, then the simple mantra is connect through heart. That is your kindness and gratitude. But I would like to know about you are such a successful personality today. Where you are, people would love to die for that position. So I want to know how this journey of yours started, how you wanted to move to this industry, how you overcome those challenges. And you can say as a woman, which you have to handle so many things. And we would love to know those things too. Yes, uh, actually, uh, I just want to say that uh, my journey is very simple. Uh, I belong uh, to a very middle class family. And in this uh, middle class family, actually, I got the lessons from my mother and my father about uh, honesty. And actually, from my childhood, uh, my father gave me mantra that honesty is the best policy. So I believe that honesty is the best policy. And if you are honest with others, if you are honest with yourself, so definitely your life become a journey, your uh, life become an inspirational one uh, for the others. So uh, if uh, I uh, would like to share my uh, some special moments uh, of my uh, special journey. So uh, actually I remembered uh, one special moment when I was in Africa and Africa is the continent, and I was in a country, Ethiopia. Ethiopia is a very beautiful country. 
and uh, actually uh, i have associated with uh, one person uh, his name is balanyu ajugna and he is a, a physiotherapist and uh, with the balanyu uh, actually uh, i uh, i just want to uh, uh, actually conduct a, a, a conduct a event uh, which is actually uh, related uh, to the honoring bahadur physiotherapy specialist uh, clinic uh, with the world standardization certification okay so uh, actually this uh, physiotherapy clinic is uh, 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 is helping uh, to the uh, persons who have the sports related injuries or uh, if you have a work related uh, problems in your muscles or your uh, or in your body so this physiotherapy uh, clinic is uh, helping to these kind of persons and uh, when i uh, meet uh, belanyu so i found that uh, he is a very humble doctor he is a very uh, decent doctor who actually wants to help uh, these kind of patients okay uh, who have uh, actually uh, who are su- suffering with the uh, muscle related injuries or uh, any kind of body ache so uh, actually i am associated with the team of the world standardization certificate and then we have to finalize that yes we have to conduct this event and uh, we have to give this kind of certificate so uh, actually in ethiopia i uh, don't know uh, so many people i don't know uh, uh, about the media but i actually uh, directly uh, contacted uh, to the ceo of the amara mass media agency and actually in india uh, we actually say that doordarshan is our uh, national channel right so uh, in the ethiopia uh, there was a national uh, television there was a national news agency was amara tv so i contacted with the ceo of the amara mass uh, media and actually he liked my idea he supported me and my whole event was telecasted on their international news channel and i got the 4 minute coverage on their international news and uh, on my whole event they made a, a very uh, very inspirational documentary and they released uh, this uh, documentary on their official youtube channel so actually uh, i thought this this is uh, uh, this is my big achievement so far uh because uh, going to the another country another cities and uh, just appearing on the uh, on their national uh, television so on their national uh, channel so uh, it's a, some kind of big thing so i believe that if if you are a very honest person if you believe in yourself so definitely people wants to connect with you people definitely will respect your ideas and whatever you want to do if you believe in yourself so so automatically people will believe in you wow this is really great dr supriya yes i do believe your values your ethics your morals defines your success and yes. it was really great to know about your ethiopia journey how you went being an indian you went to a different country and you presented the four minute which you said a documentary it was really a commendable job and that that defines how you have motivated yourself others and the world too so dr supriya this is really inspiring motivating and you have inspiring thousands and millions of today who are watching this global talk show live and who will be watching this video later on so that's really great and yes i will say to all my global audience never ever give up on your dreams and if you think to give up on your dreams better watch this video and you are going to get lot of inspiration from dr supriya's journey how she went to another country how she did and that will inspire you that will provoke you uh, motivate you not to give up on your dreams rather dart forward in your life make yourself rather than breaking up on your dreams so thank you so much for this beautiful answer dr supriya and also i would love to know by moving on the course of this global talk show 
I have seen you in associating with sustainable development goals. And recently, you have conducted an online conference, which was really, really a big, massive successful. So how you got this idea to move into a sustainable development and what kind of mission you are having for your future? So let's see that. Uh, actually, uh, I am on the mission, uh, which name is Let's Connect the Nations. Okay, and actually, uh, this is the movement uh, which is supported by, which is powered by uh, the team Expression Learning Resource Private Limited and the team Witty Gossip Association. So, uh, actually, uh, the journey of the sustainable development uh, has started uh, three years back in the COVID scenario, in the COVID 19 uh, pandemic. So, actually, uh, that time, I uh, actually I just I'm just browsing on the uh, internet and I saw the uh, event details and uh, the name of this uh, event is a World Sustainable Development Summit and uh, actually uh, I am the uh, follower of the uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi so uh, I thought uh, that uh, something is new in this event. So I searched more about this World Sustainable Development Summit. So I found that uh, this event actually organized in the month of February. And in this month of February, they only organized uh, they only organized this event for the only three days. Okay. Then I uh, then I have started to read about the sustainable development goals. Actually, these sustainable development goals are set by the United Nations. So uh, I read about these sustainable development goals. Then I found that, yes, these sustainable development goals are the life changing because each and every goal is related to each and every field of the education. Like if, uh, um, I, if I talk about the sustainable development goal 15, the goal 15 says a uh, life on land. Okay. So life and life on land is related to the agriculture. If uh, I talk about the goal 14, which is life below water. So it's all about the marine pollution, marine protection. It's all about the marine scenario. If I talk about the sustainable development goal nine, uh, that means industry, innovation, and infrastructure. So I found that yes, each and every goal is related to the all fields of the education. And why these three day, three days? We have to give uh, give a particular one day to talk to discuss about each and every goal. And we have to find out that what are the solutions to achieve the targets of each and every goal. So I planned uh, to organize, to conduct this Global Peace and Sustainable Development Summit. And actually, I remember that on the uh, on uh, year 2021, when I organized the first, uh, uh, first edition of the Global Peace and Sustainable Development Summit, so I found so many uh, educators, so many industrialists who actually wants to know more about the sustainable development goals. And I got huge uh, motivation, huge inspiration from all over the educators, from all over the uh, businessmen, from all over the different uh, founders of the different NGOs. And on that uh, 2021, uh, on the season one, on the edition one of the Global Peace Sustainable Development Summit, approximately 80 countries participated. And uh, we have around uh, 170 plus speakers, including the uh, students, including the faculty members, including the industrialists and uh, including the uh, founders and CEOs of the different national and international organizations. So I got success. Actually, people like this idea to talk about the sustainable development goals to find these kind of solutions. I did it in the 2022 
again i got huge uh, uh, we can say that uh, huge appreciations around the world and this was uh, and this time uh, it is a hat trick so uh, yeah <laughs> yes yeah. so really again uh, yes uh, this time actually we touched the figure of 350 speakers and this time we actually uh, did a, a great experience in which we actually uh, uh, we have connected so many colleges so many higher education institutes on a hybrid mode so on the different colleges of the central india the conference uh, actually took place on their uh, big auditoriums and uh, our foreign speakers the uh, other speakers who actually uh, didn't belong to the uh, particular region of the indore so they joined live uh, via zoom so we touched the uh, actually the uh, 350 speakers uh, number so actually th this was my uh, whole journey started around these sustainable development goals wow this is amazing dr supriya and your journey this is really i can say the uh, mind blowing and whatever the adjectives are not coming in my mind right now but really you have proved one that when you are doing any work with passion with dedication with respect constant and consistency definitely you are going to get success at any cost and that's what you have proved in sdg and recently i have seen your conference which was really a mega success where people were coming speakers from different uh, country parts of the world and they were speaking and they were presenting their uh, views that was really great and people were just appreciating on social media and you get lot of laurels applauds so well done keep it up dr supriya keep moving on keep inspiring people too and i wish you all the success all the very best success in your work and kind of deeds which you are doing for the society and for the humanity so really hats up to you dr supriya once again great one all right well this is all about the stg but besides this dr supriya is also into many more the uh, great work which is very beneficial for the society and for this question i would love to know dr supriya what are your dreams and what have you planned for your coming years and that will be the so much inquisitiveness among my global audience too because they are keenly waiting for this answer yes what is dr supriya plans mission vision and we will love to explore that too uh actually uh, that i uh, i already said that i am on the mission of let's connect nations okay so actually uh, with this movement let's connect nations and with the team of global peace and sustainable development summit uh i wish that uh, on the year uh, 2024 or uh, by the end of the year 2023 uh i want to make a guinness world record and in this particular guinness world record actually i want to connect all the 195 nations uh i actually believe that uh on that particular guinness world record each and every nation will have the representative of the global peace and sustainable development uh, summit and each country representative will actually help us will motivate us will encourage us to find the solutions that in what a manner we can achieve the targets of the sustainable development uh, because uh, according to the agenda of the united nations we have to achieve all the targets set by the core team of the united nations uh, we have to achieve all the targets by 2030 so uh, i believe that uh, when i will uh, i will be creating this guinness world records so in each and every country there will be a representative of the sustainable development goals so uh, actually this is my wish 
and uh, hope uh, with the blessings of all of you with the blessings of all my supporters all my followers all my well wishes definitely i will be making the guinness world uh, book of record by the year ending dr subriya there is no doubt in that you will make it the way you are progressing and the way your sdg conference is getting lot of you know tension lawrence appraisals appraisals and this is sure you are going to make it and definitely india is going to shine on your name too so i wish you all the best this vision of yours and this mission of yours really co aligned with each other and it is going by the grace of god you are going to achieve it and this is my dream too to see you shining to see you praising in the world across the globe so once again heartfelt wishes to you for your work for your uh, nations you dedication which i am seeing in your work hats off to you and lot of laurels to you dr supriya well this 25 to 30 minutes i have never ever imagined how it has passed talking to you about your work about your mission about your incredible journey and trust me dr supriya today you have inspired millions those who have plans those who have dreams but those who don't dare have courage to move on in their life and after listening this beautiful show they are going to make their life rock on so that's the guarantee i can give it to the world well by before i say goodbye and before i say bye bye to my lovely audience and dr supriya i would love to know your beautiful message today for my global audience today and across the world too yes okay so uh, my beautiful message to this whole uh, global audience i just want to say that if you want to achieve something if you want to achieve your targets if you want to achieve your objectives so just believe in yourself believe in yourself is my mantra i believe myself yet that yes i can do it everything even i can fly a plane even i can fly a aeroplane i can fly like a bird so yes you have to believe in yourself so believe in yourself is my mantra yes and this is really really a powerful message you have delivered today to the world believing in yourself can turn any impossible things into a possible thing and with this beautiful message i am taking a great honor not in ending this show but starting a new journey from extraordinary to ordinary to super ordinary dr supriya thank you so much for coming to our show and enlightening this beautiful evening with lots and lots of wisdom of nuggets so thank you so much once again and thank you so much to my global audience who are always supporting us constantly and consistently so keep doing that stay happy here and hearty bye bye for now